Well, it's that time of year again when we start thinking about your neck. Um, in reality, already started thinking about it. It's only a fortnight away as of filming this right now. So what we're looking at is I've never entered Tom's engine in, in Imlet before. It's the engine I learned to drive on. Probably driven it more than most other engines bar my Trojan probably. So this is a practice run. Uh, to have went to switch over charcoal onto coal and it has to be a reverse run which is a good good bit of fun our track in reverse is, is hard work the gradient coming out of the station in the wrong way is hard straight away with no way of doing it with passengers but here we go let's get on with it have a nose have a gander um, and I'll come back to you when we're done I said I'd come back to you, didn't I? So, conclusions. I sat with not enough charcoal in the box. Probably a spoonful or two of not enough coal in the box. Um, the charcoal was kind of breaking up as we needed it. Didn't have enough small stuff prepped. So I was kind of just handballing it in. Didn't leave with enough. So first lap, pressure dropped a bit. We got it back. But it did drop off to start with. 
Although that might be to do with more the direction we were running and how hard it is to pull away in the reverse direction. Especially the five coaches on. Um, we was all noticing, so there was four engines out this day. We was all noticing how much harder it is to pull away in reverse. Um, uh, the rolling gradient is one in hundred going up the normal way, but going up in reverse is sharper. Which, which is why I wanted to do it as a nice simulator test, pull away on an effectively an unfamiliar track with a load straight out from the charcoal fire. So less is learned from neck, more charcoal, more coal, get as much in there as possible. The charcoal is free heat, it's not counted. Uh, and we'll see what we do. I'm going to stick with a nice sensible load. Conditions pending, we'll say. Um, yeah, as of now, it's two, in two weeks' time, um, Tom would have had his run, and I'll be waiting for my run tomorrow. Yeah, see you there. Who's going? If not, I don't know if I'll be getting vi if I'll do the next three videos. I might just do like a summary of my condensing into one video. I'm not sure. Depends how manic it gets because it's thirty odd, thirty six, something thirty four, thirty six runs, which is a lot to try and catch. So um, I don't know if I'll be able to catch them all. Or if I do, it might just be like one passing shot, which might not be enough for three daily videos. It might just be one summary coming out the week following in Lek as I get back here to edit. I don't know, we'll find out. It's a mystery. It's a surprise for you and me.